Hi, I'm Dr. Mike Mandel, and this video is part of the Hypnosis Q&A series. In this particular video, I'm going to answer the question, is it possible to hypnotize a strong-willed person? Ah, the old strong-willed person question. I get this one all the time. The origin of this sort of question is the belief that someone's will will prevent hypnosis from happening. But the irony is the complete opposite is actually true, providing the subject is properly motivated to trance. In reality, the subject's will can be used to facilitate hypnosis rather than undermine it. Saying I'm too strong-willed to be hypnotized is tantamount to saying I'm so muscular and powerful I can't even lift a barbell. It's ludicrous, but unfortunately quite typical. The person who believes that he or she is too strong-willed to be hypnotized has a flawed view of what hypnosis actually is. Hypnosis is not the forceful application of the hypnotist's will on the subject will. Sort of a psychological arm wrestling, it's really a cooperative communication between the hypnotist and the subject's conscious and unconscious minds. The key word is cooperative. If the subject is properly motivated to go into trance, whether for personal development or psychotherapy, then nothing will prevent trance from occurring. It's all down to the subject's willingness, not a battle of wills. I'm Dr. Mike Mandel, and this is the truth about hypnosis. We hope you enjoyed this video, and if you'd like to get 20 videos just like this, visit MikeMandelHypnosis.com slash video and learn the truth about hypnosis.